Before we begin, I would just like to say feminism, women's rights. Now that that's out of the way, hello and welcome to my new segment, Cartoon Men I Would Sell My Body To at a Discount Price, the discount being free because I would never make these fine gentlemen pay for a whore like me. Today's gentleman is Captain Levi Ackerman. This little fruitcake stands at five foot three inches. With dead eyes and a face that's never known rest or peace, I let him take me on a one-way trip to Pound Town. Who needs a healthy relationship when you could be the sex slave of this little fun-sized assassin? His only body count consists of the people he's actually laid to rest. With more baggage than you could legally bring onto an airplane, this little Jolly Rancher is here for a bad time. But it's fine because he's scary in a fun, sexy way. His pain is your gain. Split me like you split your enemies, Captain. Join me next week to find out which cartoon character I'm throwing this slab of meat at. Welcome to today's segment of Animated Men I Would Sell My Body To At A Discount Price The Discount Being Free Because I Would Never Make These Fine Gentlemen Pay For A Like Me Today's gentleman is Aaron Yeager What can I say, I'm a lady in the streets, a Yeagerist in the sheets Lacking not only the will to live for himself, but those around him as well The toxicity level is intensely terrifying and deeply arousing This rock hard human dumpster fires, cracking skulls and breaking backs And I just pray to God God that I'm on his list. What could be hotter than staring into a pool of emerald colored eyes devoid of human emotion? In regards to his titan form, let's just say I don't have all the time in the world to explain to my therapist what a vor is. This sexcapade was doomed from the start, but I'm going all in on this hunk of anxiety fuel. Yes, daddy attack titan, let my soul be a vessel for your pain and suffering and my holes be a vessel for your throbbing heart. Join me next time to find out which animated man I'm throwing this slab of meat at. Hello, and welcome to today's segment of Animated Men I Would Sell My Body To At A Discount Price, The Discount Being Free Because I Would Never Make These Fine Gentlemen Pay For A Like Me. Today's gentleman is Howell Pendragon. Step on my dumb little neck with your expensive boots, you filthy witch. I don't care if there's not a fruitful thought behind those eyes because just look at him in these pants. If ever I saw this Renaissance Twinkie in public, we're smashing parts on sight. I'd love nothing more than going on a whirlwind adventure with this Garden Himbo 3000. Let's discover new things together. Is there a fourth hole? Can we make a new one? The possibilities are endless. This is the kind of man that will destroy your body, but wear a face mask with you after. I'm forfeiting my dignity. I am this man's trash can. That's all for today, folks. Join me next time to find out which animated gentleman I'm throwing this slab of meat at. Welcome to today's segment of Animated Men I Would Sell My Body To At A Discount Price. The discount being free because I would never make these fine gentlemen pay for like me. Today's gentleman is Gojo Satoru. If you've ever fantasized about one of the three blind mice from Shrek being a sexy man, I've got some incredible news for you. This playfully sadistic dinner plate will turn your world upside down as you experience penetration within the infinite possibilities of the universe. Sounds a lot more interesting than five minute missionary. Standing at six foot three inches, this seedy harlot is bringing the pain and pleasure to all vacant holes. I'd make an enemy out of this cursed sex machine just so he would pay attention to me. Yes, sir. I've been a very bad cursed spirit. Punish me in your domain expansion. Are we everything or are we nothing? It doesn't matter when you're getting railed in the void. I'm climaxing just thinking about it. Oh, to be a throat swollen with this arrogant bastard's gigantic penis. Join me next time to find out which animated man I'm throwing this slab of meat at. Welcome to today's episode of Animated Men I Would Sell My Body To At A Discount Price The Discount Being Free Because I Would Never Make These Fine Gentlemen Pay For me. Today's gentleman is Dazai. Wanting to die has never been hotter. This suicidal shell of a man could not only split me in half, but dice me up into little cubes. If this man's was a rainforest, I would him so dry that all vegetation and native species would die from drought and the lands would become barren and unable to produce any forms of life for generations to come. This man's entire bloodline would end in my esophagus. What's hotter than a man with nothing to lose in a dark past? Try a man with nothing to lose a dark past in a titan-sized You'll never be bored with this danger magnet beside you, on top of you, or behind you. No amount of repentance will save you after spending a night with this freak, but as you burn in hell, you'll know it was worth it. Wear that bruise on the back of your throat like a badge of honor, and congratulations on eliminating your gag reflex. That's all for today, folks. Join me next time to find out which animated man I'm throwing this slab of meat at. Welcome to today's segment of Animated Men I Would Sell My Body To At A Discount Price, The Discount Being Free Because I Would Never Make These Fine Gentlemen Pay For A Whore Like Me. 
me. Today's gentleman is Muzan Kabutsuji. I know what some of you are thinking, and despite his similarities to Michael Jackson, I would still gladly, humbly suffocate on this man's peeheeness. Nominated for the People's Choice Sexiest Mass Murderer of the Year, this man can and will devour your pussy. Live out your wildest vor fantasies with this cannibal cafe all-star. I'd like a first-class ticket to this man's stomach, please. Will you lose loved ones along the way? Yes. Will the climax be worth it? Probably. He's only had hundreds of years to perfect it. You'll have no problem opening up about your humiliation king to this demon daddy. He'd love to make you miserable. You won't ever have to worry about this demonic dom texting you back because spend a night with him and it'll probably be your last night on earth. But what's life all about if not taking chances? Go on, get railed. You deserve it. That's all for today, folks. Join me next time to find out which animated man I'm throwing this slab of meat at. Hello and welcome to today's episode of Animated Men I Would Sell My Body To at a Discount Price, the discount being free because I would never make these fine gentlemen pay for a like me. Today's gentleman is Sukuna. Rip my heart out of my chest, you treacherous wench, I've seen you do it. My biggest question is, does the carpet match the drapes? Cue intensely demonic waterfall noises. What's a gal to do with all of these mouths? This wretched specimen will absolutely leave you unread, but even that's more than you deserve with this freak. You're lucky to be alive. The only way to describe a relationship with this vermin heartthrob is ouchy ouchy daddy that hurt my mind, body, and spirit. The chances of him being kinky are 110% though. What are you doing, step cursed spirit? If you're planning on f***ing this immortal f destroyer scumbag, you truly are getting ripped tonight. R.I.P. that CA. You'll spend a week going, I don't have throat cancer, do I? That's all for today, folks. Join me next time to find out which animated man I'm throwing this slab of meat at. Welcome to today's episode of Animated Men I Would Sell My Body To at a Discount Price, the discount being free because I would never make these fine gentlemen pay for a like me. Today's gentleman is Ken Kaneki. I started wearing diapers just so I didn't leave a slug rug every time I thought about this five foot five pixie stick. Nothing would satisfy me more than letting this man use my stomach as a dumpster for millions of his unborn children. When I move around, I want to hear the swishing noises of potential teachers, firemen, presidents, mass murderers, probably mostly mass murderers. My cup runneth over. I want to get dicked down so hard by this man that I feel like charred street meat thrust upon a skewer. Gone are the days where you say, not tonight, babe, I'm on my period. This barbaric L'Oreal model will look you in the eye and say, it's that time of the month already? Even better. God didn't bless me with these honga longa mommy milker gazungas so that this early 2000s emo sperm head wouldn't take a chunk out of one of them. Go on, son, this round's on me. That's all for today, folks. Join me next time to find out which animated man I'm throwing this slab of meat at. Welcome to today's episode of Animated Men I Would Sell My Body To At A Discount Price, the discount being free because I would never make these fine gentlemen pay for like me. Today's gentleman is Ervin Smith. Tired of having your father figure and daddy dom sold separately? Stay tuned for this exciting new opportunity. He won't even need the second arm to satisfy your loins. I pray to God that getting my f***y demolished is a requirement for the betterment of humanity. Don't worry, Ervin. You might not have made it to Aaron's basement, but I'd love to introduce you to mine. It's a bird. It's a plane. No, it's a 6'2 blue-eyed Ken doll with emotional baggage and a monster car. Free will is so important, but I will become a mindless bimbo for this thick, throbbing, blonde meat. Sack. Call me dirt on a farm because I'm looking to get plowed and planted with seeds. One can only hope that he'll keep the same energy charging into your organs as he did charging to his death. Your He's about to look more torn up than Aaron's mom and Marco's face, but boy oh boy will it be worth it. That's all for today, folks. Join me next time to find out which animated man I'm throwing this slab of meat at. Welcome to today's episode of Animated Man I Would Sell My Body To at a discount price, the discount being free because I would never make these fine gentlemen pay for a whore like me. Today's gentleman is Hattori Soma. Or for Hattori, unite. I've got a fever and the only cure is more Hattori. This is one pelvic exam I will be shaving for. If you love adult emos with job security, look no further. Further. This devastated smoke show of a seahorse is gonna rock you inside and out. Doctor, doctor, give me the news. I've got a bad case of wanting to sit on your face. I could go on and on about all the ways I would feast upon this thick, juicy, pussy penetrator 9000, and I will. I would take a few hits from Akito to get what I want, and it would be dishonest of me if I said that I probably wouldn't enjoy that as well. Let your heart soothe the wounds of this emotional baggage claim of a man while his leaves new wounds in the back of your esophagus. That's all for today, folks. Join me next time to find out which animated man I'm throwing this slab of meat at. Welcome to today's episode of Animated Man I Would Sell My Body To at a Discount Price, the discount being free because I would never make these fine gentlemen pay for
like me. Today's gentleman is Sebastian. Boy oh boy, there's nothing I love more than a lanky goth murderer who will certainly kill me. I can't say I hate the idea of him swallowing my soul. I guess at the end of the day we both swallow. It's important to have things in common. This bloodthirsty emo pastry will rob you of your innocence and wash the hell out of your dishes. There's nothing hotter than a man with a sense of responsibility and a dark secret. Life is so full of uncertainties. Why not make your certain death set in stone and enjoy the ride along the way? By ride, I do mean riding this ravenous demonic playboy. I can't help but be aroused by subtle rage. I wouldn't even care if he turned me into a meat pie so long as he ate me. Sebastian, if you must kill me, at least suffocate me with those ass cheeks. Be a real one. Yeah, I absolutely am ready to risk it all for this Victorian era My Chemical Romance praying mantis. That's all for today, folks. Join me next time to find out which animated man I'm throwing this slab of meat at. Hello and welcome to today's episode of Animated Men I Would Sell My Body To At A Discount Price. The discount being free because I would never make these fine gentlemen pay for like me. Today's gentleman is Shigure Soma. Doggy style just got a whole new meaning. Just say you have a degradation kink and a strained relationship with your father and go. You know what's sexier than love and stability? Pain in this man's penis. Do you love being left on red, constantly distressed, relationship ambiguity, secrets, and no trust? You should probably go to therapy or give this beautiful sociopath a shot. Warning, may cause anxiety in a shredded ass. I want this piece of garbage to take a two-week vacation in my pussy. It's fine, I had no self-respect in the first place and there's a vacancy in my throat. Let your self-loathing steep like hot tea after a night spent with this enchanting perverted roach goblin. That's all for today, folks. Join me next time to find out which animated man I'm throwing this slab of meat at. Welcome to today's episode of Animated Men I Would Sell My Body To at a discount price. The discount being free because I would never make these fine gentlemen pay for like me. Today's gentleman is Prince Diamond. What could moisten your loins more than a homicidal maniac that looks like a flower? It's the way that I would suck on a jellyfish just so he'd have to piss in my mouth. This man's personality is like if you took a photo of a raccoon in a dumpster and then popped an Instagram sparkle filter on top of it. This euphoric sewer rat will crush your heart, body, and spirit, but it'll hurt so good and bad. If ever the day comes that this man springs into existence and kidnaps me, don't come looking for me. Leave me be. Tell the search parties to go home. I'm a human fleshlight now. Let me have this one. Don't f this up for me. Imagine grabbing a fistful of silver hair from a beautiful psychopath who wants to destroy humanity but only has eyes for you. Pros outweigh the cons if you're a toxic freak and don't forget to ask your doctor if getting railed is right for you. That's all for today folks. Join me next time to find out which animated man I'm throwing this slab of meat at. Welcome to today's episode of Animated Men I Would Sell My Body To At A Discount Price. The discount being free because I would never make these fine gentlemen pay for like me. Today's gentleman is Jean Kirstein. If there's one thing I've learned on the internet over the past year, it's that the giant horse weighs over 11 pounds. This rugged stallion will honestly be so grateful to have you pay attention to him and not the other two emos. He'll saddle himself up and take you on the ride of your life. This is the kind of man that doesn't have to ask, was this good for you? He knows it was. He made sure of it. What that mouth do, horse boy? Could accept chlamydia from this man as if it was an early birthday present. This man will fold you like a lawn chair you've owned since the 90s, spread you like butter on Cheesecake Factory bread, bend you like the Avatar, and wreck you like the Titanic. I almost wish I was a titan so I could experience the joy of getting split by this ripped, ragged, and rugged Sheriff Woody. A natural born leader with character development. Who wouldn't want to get stuffed? Fight the good fight, you Wild West himbo. That's all for today, folks. Join me next time to find out which animated man I'm throwing this slab of meat at. Welcome to today's episode of Animated Man I Would Sell My Body To At A Discount Price. The discount being free because I would never make these fine gentlemen pay for a like me. Today's gentleman is Joe. Sorry, Mia. This is actually my daddy. Ignore that sound. It's just my loins screaming screaming into the abyss. This revamped sexy Shrek will definitely make a swamp out of your downstairs palace. What do I want more, his fatherly wisdom or his strong hands wrapped around my throat? Find out next time on I didn't receive enough love as a child. This cilantro headed sex menace will make you come so many times you'll ask yourself, is this a waterbed? There's nothing better than getting railed and having a man make you homemade fettuccine after. You'll need to fuel up for round two. Cherry calls him a thirsty gorilla like it's an insult. How thirsty, Joe? Show me how primal you are. Let me introduce you to this gorilla grip. This rock hard veggie tails heartthrob has mommy milkies big enough to feed a village and I'm feeling parched. That's all for today, folks. Join me next time to find out which animated man I'm throwing this slab of meat at. Hello and welcome to today's episode of Animated Man I Would Sell My Body To at a discount price, the discount being free because I would never make these fine gentlemen pay for a like me. Today's gentleman is Cherry Blossom. 
Call me Carla because I want this man to step on my neck. This suave bubblegum baby will belittle you, but he'll always get the job done because he hates losing. As long as you drop the fast and keep the furious in bed, we have no problem. This sexy humanized jigglypuff is breaking more backs than records. I want to nurse this man back to health with my bra after that incident with Adam. Blend my internal organs with your Nutribullet you sultry summer fruit salad. Don't even get me started on matcha blossom. Oh no, I'd hate to be caught in the middle of that tension. There's just no way this man doesn't taste like Skittles. Please whip me in the face with those My Little Pony locks, mommy. That's all for today, folks. Join me next time to find out which animated man I'm throwing this slab of meat at. Welcome to today's episode of Animated Men I Would Sell My Body To at a discount price, the discount being free because I would never make these fine gentlemen pay for a like me. Today's gentleman is Nanami Kenta. Not interested in the unstable cursed Timba? Try his significantly more put together co-worker. This man will sit you down on his lap and explain the stock market to you. This smutty wolf of Wall Street could make a housewife out of any person he meets, including the enemy. This punctual LinkedIn daddy will make you behave, but that cream suit, blue shirt, leopard print tie combo means he also has a fun side. Oh, to be a napkin, absorbing the bodily fluids on his bloodied torso. If you're looking for a strong man to hold you and a proper father figure your dad could never be. This white collar slasher checks all of the boxes. Talk to me about the future of crypto while taking me on the stove in our upper middle class suburban home corporate bay. I will give up all of my human rights to become this man's personal s disposal. That's all for today folks. Join me next time to find out which animated man I'm throwing this slab of meat at. Welcome to today's episode of Animated men I would sell my body to at a discount price, the discount being free because I would never make these fine gentlemen pay for a like me. Today's gentleman is Gurren Ichinos. From the makers of Men Against Therapy and Violence, we're proud to introduce this six foot Levi Ackerman who's worse at his job and more of a dick about it. I just love a man in uniform. If you love a cocky bastard with violent eyes who's full of secrets, look no further. You want a man who's gonna be a project, you say? His ex-girlfriend is a sword. He might not be a vampire, but I would let him suck all of the blood out of my body. This pile of hot garbage is constantly hanging on by a thread. This demonic himbo is like catnip for masochistic brats everywhere. Lieutenant, please plunge your meat sword into my deepest crevices. A crumb of punishment is all I ask for, Lieutenant. Make me feel alive for once in this hellish fever dream we call life. That's all for today, folks. Join me next time to find out which animated man I'm throwing this slab of meat at.